Like everything during the pandemic, the Blackfeet Nation Boxing Club has had to get creative in order to host classes this year. We did have people in our community that wanted to do one specifically at the college, and we were really open to it. And again, just the COVID thing, can we talk to ESPN about that? And they were like, well, how about we make it, you know, national? So they're teaching their classes online. On Saturday, they'll team up with ESPN, Overthrow New York, and a number of professional fighters to host a free virtual class. It's really important to be able to take care of yourself if you have no one else there to protect you. They'll not only teach boxing and self-defense, but they'll also host a Q&A that will touch on the topic of missing and murdered Indigenous women. For short, MMIW. This is a crisis. Lifelong Blackfeet boxer Donna Kipp was a main character in ESPN's documentary, Blackfeet Boxing Not Invisible. And she says even though this topic is new to some, for her, it's something she's known her whole life. I went to places and they're like, what does that even stand for? This is actually happening. People like just broke out in tears because they were so astounded about what's going on in the world. And they're pretty much blindfolded to it because it's such kept in the corner of a closet. And now that their story is out in the open, she says more people have wanted to learn how to defend themselves. A few things participants will learn is the correct stance, how to throw your punches, and most importantly, how young girls and women can learn how to protect themselves. You need that security, you know? It's not saying a woman cannot power a man because physically that's really not possible, but to know they, you know, fought them, they're scratching or so something, if they leave their DNA on that man, at least it will help them and maybe help more girls in the future. You can learn more about the event at overthrownyc.com. Reporting for SWX from Bozeman, I'm Alex Eshelman.